Thank you for tuning in to Everything Valves, the channel dedicated to bringing you Everything Valves. In today's video, we will be disassembling a wedge gate valve. Here we have a flanged in wedge gate valve. As you can see, you have your gate here. Your stem is up here. This area right here is your seat surface. You have your bonnet here, your bonnet bolts. This is gonna be your yoke. This is your gland flange here. These are your bolts. When you tighten down this flange, it'll push down your gland here, which will compress any packing here. To close the valve, you wanna rotate clockwise. To open the valve, you rotate counterclockwise. To show you the inside of the bonnet, I'm going to use a cutout I have here and show you how to disassemble it. You want to remove your stem nut here. With your stem nut. Now you should be able to remove your hand wheel here, your hand wheel. Now you have this bushing here, which is threaded. As you can see, it threads onto the stem itself. Now we want to begin to unthread the stem here. See, now it is out. Now you should be able to pull your stem completely out. Here you have your stem, and this would be the slot where your wedge will slide over. Now you have your gland flange, and it has bolts here, nuts, so you wanna remove these. Now you remove your last one and you should be able to pull out the gland flange here. Here you have your gland flange. So now you should be able to remove your gland here. Here's your gland, which compresses the packing rings here. And now you can remove this bushing on top, which your stem will thread inside of here. And here is your bonnet. Inside you have your packing, as you can see all the rings inside. This surface right here is actually your back seat. This bevel surface right here acts as a back seat, sealing against this area inside of the bonnet. When the valve opens, it creates a seal and there at the bottom preventing any flow from entering the packing. And if it does, you tighten down your gland to compress these packing rings and stop any leak. So here you have all your components. You have the valve body here. This is gonna be the gate right here. You have your hand wheel. Here you have your stem nut, your stem bushing, your stem, your gland flange, your gland, your gland bolting here, and this is your bonnet right here. These are all the components that make up a wedge gate valve. Design may vary between manufacturers, but they all follow the same concept. If you enjoyed today's video, please like and subscribe for more valve videos. Thank you for tuning in to Everything Valves, and we'll see you in the next video.